Hey, hey guys. guys, it's Crystal and Chris and we're back at City Walk today So we've been hearing that there's been a lot of new things opening up So we definitely wanted to come and check it out for ourselves. Yeah, we're also here to grab some lunch Which is also our favorite thing to do. Yes. Right. So let's yes. go see what's new, right? Let's ready? go All right, so first thing is first we have to eat. We have to have some food, right? Yeah. So we're actually gonna try Vivo Italian Kitchen. Opened up not too long ago. It's yeah. actually one of the newer restaurants here at City Walk. And we grabbed the menu. So we hear they have some really good food. Uh, and Chris actually loves Italian food, and yes. I do too, right? Do you know what you're gonna get? I think I'm gonna get some pasta. We'll show. We'll show you the menu right now. But yeah. I think I'm gonna grab some pizza. I'm feeling some pizza right now. Yeah. So let's go in there. All right, so you'll find Vivo actually right next to Sephora and the Dodger Clubhouse. It's going to be right across the Hot Topic and the guest store, and they got Ben & Jerry's. So this is actually closer to the entrance of the park. The park is that way, and obviously self-parking, you come from that direction. So it's right in between the parking and the entrance to the theme park. So we just ordered our food. Yes. What'd you get, sweetie? Um, so I ended up getting the chicken fettuccine alfredo. Mm -hmm. what and you get? I ordered the chicken pesto pizza. Looking forward yes. to it. Yeah. So actually, here's a look at the menu. All right. So obviously they have pizzas, they have pastas, and side salad. The menu's actually not that big right now. Um, I just think they're just keeping it small and simple for now. But yeah, they got cheese pizza, mushroom, prosciutto, big eye pepperoni, margarita, chicken pesto. So we got some H2O, and then I actually got a Arnold Palmer iced tea. Yeah, I don't know if I'm wrong, but I think the pizzas they just added, right? Because I I saw a sign before, when, right when we were driving in, that said now serving pizzas, and then there's a now serving pizza over there. Oh, okay, that's right. All right, guys, the food is here. Let's see a food unboxing. So I ordered the fettuccine alfredo. It looks good. I'm excited. Let's check out my pizza. What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna need a slice of that, babe. There won't be no extra. <laughs> I'm not looking for this. My pizza. <laughs> but why'd they put a salad on top of my pizza? The aftermath. That was really good. That was delicious. I didn't think I was gonna finish my pizza. I think it was pretty big, but. Uh, Guys, I didn't even help him. Why you gotta put me on blast like that? <laughs> all right, so we're done eating. What do you think about the food after all? It was delicious. Yeah. I'm so full and I'm so satisfied. It was really good. Yeah. The pizza was uh, definitely a like if you guys have had personal size pizza, it's a little bit bigger than that. Um, yeah. You could probably share it if you're not like that hungry, but I obviously ate the Does whole that thing. Mean you were hungry? Yeah, I was hungry because <laughs> I ate the whole thing, so I was hungry. I literally only took one bite. <laughs> Her fettuccine alfredo was actually really yeah. good. Her pasta was delicious. Yeah. And actually, every time I usually go to a restaurant, I usually order fettuccine alfredo. Yeah. So she would know if, yeah, if it's, good, if it's or good or not. Yeah. yeah. And that one was really delicious. Yeah. So we would actually have Vivo again. It was really good. I would probably try the pepperoni pizza next time. Decent size, decent portions, and it's not that expensive. I mean, it's a little pricey, but hey, it's City Walk. Yeah. So what do you expect? I would give it two thumbs up. Same here. So let's go check out the new store. We're excited for this part. Let's go. Let's go. Right, here it is, Production Central. It's City Walk's newest store. And we're gonna go check out all the merch that they have in there. We're about to go broke in here. Yeah, we're about to spend <laughs> all of our money. Yeah. Wow. So it looks like they have the, kind of like a retro, right, babe? Yeah, they have the retro. Look at that shirt. <laughs> Guys, I'm in trouble. Yeah, so it looks like they have a lot of merch from the movies. They got a little Back to the Future section here. Uh, Back to the Future is actually one of my favorite trilogies. They got the DeLoreans and everything. Oh, it's really cool in here. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> we can take that one. That one fits on our bookshelf. I'm gonna come get this one day, but I don't think it's gonna fit in our bookshelf. We're gonna have to make room for that. You give me permission to do that? Just buy another. Yeah, we'll just buy another bookshelf. Alright, so they do have new lanyards. Looks like they have all the old movies. It's kind of like their theme this year. It's like the retro theme. E.T., Jaws, Back to the Future. Um, so these are new lanyards and they also have new masks. They have new Harry Potter themed masks. They have all the houses. 
Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, and Ravenclaw. The one thing that I do notice, I don't know if you noticed, but usually lanyards come with their own pouch, but look, now they're actually charging you separate for the pouch. Oh, that's true, huh? Yeah. The lanyard pouch is separate. I actually really like that one, too. Yeah, me too, but isn't that odd? Yeah, that's true, because they usually come, they come with it. Yeah, but they're trying to make that money. And they got more face masks here. And it looks like they do have dressing rooms, but you probably can't use them right now. I don't think they let you try on any of the stuff. Uh, because they do sell a lot of clothes. So yeah, they do have a lot of Halloween merch. They have all the Monsters merch here. Um, doesn't look like they have anything that's new because most of this stuff they had last year. And they actually had all of this stuff inside one of the, one of the stores. Yeah, it was already part of one of the... Like displays. Yeah. So they just had all this, they already had all this stuff. Got their posters. Alright, Sudi, so what are you gonna buy? Did you make up your mind? Yeah. So I think tell them to start packing one of each of everything. Um, because I'm taking everything. What? Can you give me your wallet? <laughs> yeah. So as you can see the park is still closed. Can't believe it's been so long since March, you guys. Again, we're guessing that they're gonna open um september that's our guess but then yet again we've been saying that every month we're like oh they're gonna open in august nope. in july too we're like oh they're gonna open in july okay so we actually found out they were supposed to open in july some of the rumors were that they were actually gonna open in july they had everything prepped but then the state kind of like closed everything down again right fingers crossed the next time you guys see us here fingers crossed we'll be able to go through these gates again yeah. one last time Do you think we can buy that? Just take it. Price. I love that. Yeah, me too. That'd be so cool. All right, guys. So obviously we've already been in this store, but we just kind of want to do a quick walkthrough and see if they have anything new. But it looks like everything is still the same, right? Yeah. Pretty much the same layout. Yeah. And then as far as the retro section, pretty much what they have here, they also have at the new store. All right, guys. We're gonna let you guys into a little secret. So if you're here walking around and you get really hot, come into the store. If you look up there, air conditioning opening, stand right under them, you feel like a really good breeze. So right now we're like so hot, I was like, let's go to the spot. <laughs> Don't tell anybody, shh. <laughs> Alright, so one of the things you guys have to know about us is that we love, absolutely love Halloween. Yes. That's been my favorite holiday ever since I was a kid. And we actually go all out uh, at our place. We decorate the whole living room, the whole kitchen. It is awesome. We can't wait for October so we can show you. You guys are in for a treat if you guys love Halloween just as much as I do. I'm so excited. You're not going to want to miss yeah. it. So. And I'm already convincing him that we're going to start decorating early, right? Right? Yes. Right? September. <laughs> we'll start decorating in September, but October 1st. Yeah. We'll show you guys exactly yeah. what it looks like. So be on the lookout for that video. Yes. Yeah, they definitely have some new pins. These pins are incredible. Look at this. Little tram moves. This thing is awesome. I'm definitely getting this. So there is a sign here in front of the grill, the NBC Sports Grill and Brew that says opening soon. And they do have outdoor seating here. So that is pretty exciting. We might be able to get to try this place pretty soon. 
All right, guys. So this is, was actually a pretty quick video, right? But yeah. the food was good. We had fun filming it. It's yeah. always nice to just come walk around at City Walk. Um, it's always nice to just be close to the park. <laughs> yeah. If you guys do come, make sure you check out their new store. Yeah. So as soon as this video is over, head over to our Instagram. Yes, Don't forget yes. to follow us. We are going to be giving away some Universal merch yes. really soon, and we're going to announce it on there. Yeah. So if you're watching, you right now, <laughs> I hope you're a winner. But it's going to be random, so yeah. go follow us on Instagram right away. Hopefully next time we're here at Universal, we'll be inside the park. Love you guys. Bye guys, Bye. take care. Bye.